what Waldorf does for you is it definitely gives you this total curiosity about the world. There's kind of this Waldorf effect of being so eager to learn and curious about everything. Instead of it being kind of mashed down and packed into boxes, you just get to kind of flourish into that. The thing with Waldorf is they teach you how to learn. And not only do they teach you how to learn, they teach you how to want to learn. Creating this desire and ability to find the answers that need to be found and to seek out the information that you need, which really gave me, I feel, a wonderful base, particularly in those sciences that I kind of drifted towards um, later on in my education. I could land anywhere and hit the ground running without really skipping a beat. I can't promise that I'll only do film for the rest of my life. I'm going to do it until I stop loving it. And I think having that confidence that I have permission to do that is something that Waldorf really instills within you. I really enjoyed the arts um, and, of course, a lot of the, the kinesthetic stuff. Metal smithing, handwork. I still knit and sew today. The artistic kind of fields or disciplines that we did, I think, really contribute to this, this idea of thinking outside the box and thinking about what other ways can we approach situations? How can we be creative? And I think that's really important when you work in a large bureaucracy like I do. One of the things I've noticed with, with the kind of the performance arts that Walder focuses on, so both things like your rhythm, when you do performances, when you stand up on stage and sing, um, the theater, you know, what I think is really amazing is Every student has to do that. And I think because of that, everyone gets a certain type of comfort level in front of people. And no matter what industry you're in, that's going to come in handy. Going in for a job interview, something as simple as that, having an experience where you've been in front of large groups, maybe in something that you aren't so comfortable in, is going to make a big difference. The activities we did in crafts, knitting, working with wood, working with stone, manipulating objects, allowed me to develop this idea of, with a sense of shape and, and geometry, a you know, relation between objects. To manipulate something quite simple and make something complex, that you have to have a picture in your mind before you can actually make it, um, I think helps a lot um, when you try to, to make a model of, of an object in space. This is certainly one of the, the key aspects of uh, going through a Waldorf education. It gives you that kind of a little bit of a, a superhero complex. That's the only danger of sending your kid there. <laughs>